I'm scared. I mean, it's okay to be scared, but like, what am I doing? I don't know what I'm doing. You're yeah, so annoying. <laughs> I'm sweet. You know when your teacher just wants to do that? If you, I've been off since like 4 a.m. There's 268 pages. I've been on page two for like the last one hour. My principle for every exam is to never leave any question unanswered. Guys, I'm doing my exams. The boy is now in fifth year. No longer fourth year, A1. I didn't want to document this, um, my exam process, but I don't know, I just feel like I should just document it. I, I hope this goes out. What am I doing? I don't know what I'm doing. My exam is on Wednesday, that's one day from now, and I don't know how I feel. I'm just overwhelmed. The exams, like, I've been studying, I've been studying, I'm just, I'm scared. I mean, it's okay to be scared, but, like, I really want to pass. I want to pass because I've actually studied. We actually had, I had a really short time to study for the, for the entire exam. Like, we literally just stopped learning, like, three days ago, and I don't know, my school is just on some, on some type of... <laughs> This is just like one day before the exam and it's Monday today, the exam's on Wednesday and it's already 8.29 p.m. So welcome to this video. If this is the first time you see me on your screen, my name is DTP, that is Professor Iwan. <laughs> and I am a medical student, photographer, videographer, whatever you want to call me. I'm, I'm a lot of things and I am a master sweet boy. <laughs> Do not hit that subscribe button, like the video, smash the notification bell and Sit tight, grab your popcorn, grab your snacks, and enjoy the rest of the vlog. Oh my god, it's it's been a long day of studying. Like, I'm literally just about to have my bath now. Like, guys, I've been studying since morning, since morning, and it's already 4 p.m. I don't know how this is gonna go. I'm actually very scared. I'm tired, I'm exhausted. I don't know how I feel. As you can see, I don't know if you guys can see if, how, how much weight I've lost. This is the exam stress all over my face. I don't know, I'm going to talk. I'm supposed to be studying now. There's no time. The exam is tomorrow morning. Guys, it's tomorrow morning. I don't know why I'm smiling. <laughs> I'm so, so scared. <laughs> no, I'm going to check on you guys. Maybe this night after the night before, before I sleep or tomorrow morning. Or after the exam tomorrow. If everything goes well or when everything goes well. I'm going to see you guys later. It is 10.36 p.m. I'm starting from the comfort of my bed with the assistance of the wireless mouse. This is very, very cozy. And I know this is not the best position to stay in to study, but like, bro, I'm literally not having it. I'm over these exams, I'm over everything. I just want the exams to come and go. Guys, I have set my alarm for 4 a.m. tomorrow to wake up and also revise. I see a lot of things I have not revised. Like, I don't know, man. Like, having exams in my school is not easy. Literally, we stopped learning on, I don't know if I mentioned this already, but we stopped learning on Saturday. It's just crazy. Like, my school is, uh, it's going to be fine by God's grace. I'm going to do very well. Amen. So I'm going to see you guys tomorrow or after the exams. After I pass, of course. Alright, so I'm going to see you guys later. Fighting, fighting. I didn't know anything. I swear. <laughs> say hi to him. Why did shy? About to take over. Do you understand the route? Though? Oh my god. I am doing that exam. Surgery is out of the way. Mouche eating, ramen noodles, boiled egg. So I don't know. I don't know how this video, how I'm going to teach you guys about how the, this exam went. All I want to know, all I want you guys to know is that it was nice. <laughs> it was also a boy, um, you know. Hmm. So surgery is out of the way now. So I have obstetrics exam on Monday. After obstetrics, I have two more exams, right? Or oh, three, sorry. Hi! Say hi to my YouTube. Hi! My name is So Actually, my name is Dr. Nonso. And I'm. Um, <laughs> and I'm on. You want O's? YouTube channel. YouTube channel. Thanks for joining me. It's time to come to my channel. That was Drag Guy Diddy, Black Color Diddy. Oh, man. Martins. You may go like. Make me go chop that shit now. Oh, man. Which is that? Which do you want to see that? Very what? No, no, you... Oh, really? You don't like soft things? I like soft things. <laughs> 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 Why are you saying that? You're so annoying. I swear. Since this exam started, I haven't been able to go to the gym because, like, going to the gym, be committing to the gym and back, and then the time at the gym is going to take a lot of time. So. I've just been sticking to home workouts and I don't know. I've not, I've not gotten fat. <laughs> I've just been trying to keep fit with just working out at home, just doing 50 push ups and sit ups and planks and stuff like that. I've been awake since like 8 17 or thereabouts, studying, studying past, past question papers for the exam. And I must say, it's actually very, very long, demanding. It's not, it's not as easy as I thought. 
what's going on youtube so it's sunday today and i just finished from church so i'm about to go back home now i'm gonna finish my studying of obstetric i am i think i am 60 percent ready 60 percent 60 percent is a lot actually but like i don't think i'm ready but i i am confident by god's grace the exam is going to be good tomorrow update on how my sunday went i played drums in church today with all my heart praising the lord <laughs> Hey guys, so I'm actually back home from this exam and I'm just here to just teach you guys on what happened. See, I am literally tired. Like, you know when a teacher just wants to actually feel you. So after like the exam, first of all, let me just teach you guys. I've been off since like 4 a.m. I went to the we went to the hospital at 7 a.m. Then we were there till like 8. Then we did the computer test in the hospital. Before I was called to the exam hall to answer my question, they were like 15 people there. But somehow, somehow, I was the last person to leave the whole building. Like I was the last student to leave. I got my question, I got my variant. I could answer number one. I asked I could answer number two perfectly well, number and the task perfectly well. So let's assume you want to give me three, five, five. The thing divided by three is a four actually. This woman was asking me to film me. She wanted to listen to what I was saying. She asked me treatment for preeclampsia, bro. I I destroyed this treatment. Ask me everything. Ask me the diagnosis. She didn't. She didn't even acknowledge the ones I got right. She was just like, you know, when a teacher just wants to actually just feel you, just wants to just give you a low score. So she now opened my my Zatros book to give me my to write my three now. As she opened it, she was not like she saw my other scores and I was like, oh, okay, I can see your score. That if you want to get a five or a four, that she can give me two. That she can feel me for this exam and I'll go and receipt for the exam next semester. Who wants to come back to obstetrics department next semester? So this is just me just basically ranting because today was a very very bad day to me it didn't go as i planned what can i say i just first of all i just want to thank god i actually passed that's one that's one reason to thank god for i'm just very angry like i don't even know what to say like you really really pain me like i'm really really pain it's, i don't know i'm just going to sleep now because i'm actually i'm literally, I'm literally stressed i'm not having it like see you guys later three steps first of march sorry me and i have an exam in three days public health and i just opened the material for the exam and i must say it's a lot <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what to do. Like, there's 268 pages. I've been on page two for like the last one hour. But anyway, I'm gonna check on you guys later. For now, your boy signing out. Just touch up, teach you guys. All right, YouTube, I'm back home. I just finished my public health exam, and it went spectacularly, spectacularly very well. I went for this exam this morning. Let me give you guys the, the backstory. I could not study for this exam. You know, when you just know very basic random information that somehow is unnecessary. Those are the those are the things I knew. The ones I tried to study, actually, I could not study. I tried my best. I I, stood, I sat down. I wrote, wrote, wrote. Like after I finished writing, I tried to recall. Nothing was coming back. I was like, wow. This I'm going to do this exam like this and not pass. People that had the exam before now were like, you can use your phone. Like teachers are very chill and. They didn't even check for the phone. Only for us to get to the exam hall, bro. Nobody could use their, could use their phone. Like these teachers were like everywhere. I bed eye view looking at all of us. How am I going to do this? Yeah, when I took my paper now, I mistakenly took two papers. So I went to sit down. Then I was like, and I checked the paper. I checked the first paper. I didn't know some answers. And I checked the second paper I took. I knew everything. I wanted to go and return the one I did not know and take the one I knew. Before you when you take a paper, they record the number of the variants, number you take. Unless I took I took variant one and I took variant one and two for example. I wanted to return one and take and keep two for myself, but the one had already recorded variant one, so it was impossible for me to actually take variants too. So I was like, ah oh god, what is this? I sat down and closed my eyes and I opened my eyes and I said I looked at everything. I was like, wow, 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 okay, I can't say I can't say I can't say this, I can't I can use common sense for this. Alright, so I began to so I began to draft my answer. My principle for every exam is to never leave any question unanswered. Like no matter what, even if I'm going to go and say rubbish, let me say that rubbish. Let the teacher shout at me and let the teacher embarrass me. I don't care. But for every question, no question, no question is left unanswered. And that hack has been helping me since secondary school. I was hoping that a good teacher got my 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 Satchel's book. Alright, so the woman I got my Zachot book. Funny, funny how during I've had a cycle, a class with her before and she was very mean to me. But during the exam, she just took my exam paper and then she looked at it, looked at it, and gave me back the exam paper and took my shoe and she began to answer. Bro, I just started talking there. I just didn't talk, I just didn't talk, I was like, this one, this one, that one, this one, this one, that one. Uh, okay, yeah, madam, so I think this is I was just beginning English for this one. <laughs> It's not like I was seeing rubbish, but like you know, it's not when you're just flowing, flowing, flowing. Even things I didn't I didn't remember, I started to come back. Like 
since I didn't even add this in my draft, we're coming back, I was just talking. Ah, Kara Shaw, Kara Shaw, she just, oh, as I'm talking, she just already gave me the score. I was like, well, yeah, yeah. In my mind, I was like, what is happening here? <laughs> After everything, she gave me my final score and accumulated everything. And yeah, your boy passed with the, the flying colors. I'm really happy for that. And all the glory just has to return to God because, I mean, it was just God at this. I, di I literally didn't study for this exam. Fact. But God just came through for me and, you know, helped me to pass. And remember very random things I didn't know I had in my head. Yeah. Alright, so that means this this the exam is off to a good track again because after obstetrics I was really sad like my I had to go for this exam and obstetrics obstetrics just spoiled the whole thing for me. But I mean it's all good. So the next exam I have is neurology. Neurology is a very interesting subject. Like I love neurology so much. But that means it should not be it should not be that difficult actually. It's really good to be walking in the park. That's what I always say. I always believe it's it's good to be walking in the park. The most difficult exam I think is going to be therapy. Like that one I really, I really have to sit down and actually study and dissect and learn in CG, learn X-ray. By God's grace, it's actually going to go very well, especially for therapy. Your boy is gradually entering the 50th. So you know I'll be 50 50 medical student. No more. Like just like yesterday I came here for first year and I'm already I'm entering, I'm entering 50th. Oh my god, it's good, man. So I'm gonna check you guys later. Enjoy the rest of the video. Hey guys, alright, so uh, <laughs> so it's the day before a neurology exam. It is 9.29 p.m. I'm not done studying yet. I've read enough to pass. <laughs> but I'm not yet done. Well, I'm just basically just going to study, set my alarm for tomorrow morning, wake up, get dressed, catch the bus, get to the hospital. So I'm just going to, you know, just stop talking right now and go and finish my studying. Hit the subscribe button if you've got to this point of the video. Smash that like button. Okay, bye. Bye-bye. So I'm going to be sleeping soon, actually. I'm going to see you guys, uh, see you guys tomorrow. I know I've said it already, but like, I just feel like I should talk to the camera again because I'm actually very, very tired. And like, yeah, I'm just glad it's going to be over this week. I, mean, I never thought I would have been able to do five exams physically, but here I am, tomorrow is my fourth exam. Yeah. Bro, I'm done with neurology, guys. Like, I am. <laughs> First of all, the exam went very exceptionally well. I must say that first and I'm actually happy because I'm 80% done with my exams. Therapy is the last exam I have on Saturday. So I'm hoping that it's going to, that's, for me that's the hardest, that's going to be the hardest exam because I have a lot of things to study. I have ECG, I have blood analysis to learn, to learn. I have, uh, what else again? X-ray to learn too. So it's going to be like the most technical exam basically. So. I'm going to start studying from this evening, but I'm, I'm going home now to go and sleep because I'm on, I'm, I'm functioning on three hours sleep. Ah, I'm tired. So I'm going to check with you guys later when I get home. Hey guys, what's up? It's your boy DTP. Guys, I'm doing my exams. Like, I don't know, I don't know how to, to express, to show my joy. Five exams. It hasn't been easy. First of all, all the glory belongs to Jesus for giving me the grace and the strength to do all these exams and to pass. It was not easy, like, I'm not going to lie to you. Your boy is now in fifth year, so longer than fourth year A1. Look at, look at how small he was of yesterday. From first year now, he's already fifth year. Oh, bro, what, 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 what's happening? After this exam, you know, I'm not yet on holiday though. We're having summer practice. So annoying. We're having summer practice at the hospital, which starts on Tuesday. So today is Friday, today is Saturday. So I only have Saturday, Sunday, and Monday because Monday is public holiday in Russia. So I don't know. I don't know, I think this is the end of the video guys, I don't even know what to say again. Alright, what's going on YouTube? So I'm back home, I look scrumptious, I look delicious, I look... Oh my god! I, I couldn't cut my hair because bro, whenever, whenever I'm, I'm in exam mood, nothing, nothing, nothing else crosses my mind, I don't care about how I look, I just want to pass my exams, I'm passed, so now I'm done with all my exams, I'm, I'm back to uh, DTP. Yeah, I'm going to see you guys later, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog actually, because I, I mean, I mean, I mean, make sure you hit the subscribe button, smash the like button, turn on your post notifications, and I'll see you guys in the next video, so then it's your boy DTP signing out to L2. Share this video see if you enjoyed it. Uh, more than I would say. See you guys later in the next week. Expect more videos from me this summer because your boy is about to take over. Alright, so I'm gonna see you guys later. Take care of yourselves, stay safe, chop life, and bye bye. I promise you can call on me. You call and call and you call and call and